Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we have got a bit of a different video, hence the fact I am in a dress like this. I am working with JGS House Official, so I don't know if you've heard of that store before. It's an online warehouse store which basically has dresses for weddings, formal events, proms, anything kind of formal related online and they have the most beautiful dresses for really, really good prices. I have been sent a few to review for you. I have worked with them before, so I've got a lot of dresses to show you. So I cannot wait to um, through them all with you. I have also got a code for you, which is Tenkiandra, which gives you 10% off everything on the site. Literally, you can get everything and it's custom order as well. So I didn't need to do that. I just got a UK size six, which is a US size two, I think, or a US size zero. They do all the way down to a US size zero. You can also get custom measurements. So like you can measure your bust and things like that. But it's super, super, super good. Look at this dress. Like this is the first one that I'm going to show you. They have all different types of colours for every dress so I could have picked this in any colour like custom made but it's absolutely gorgeous and they are so affordable. The most expensive dress I've ever sort of got from there is about 250 They ship to anywhere in the world so it's really really good. So I'm going to come up close and show you this dress. So I don't know if you can see the back there but it just goes down like that with adjustable straps so this is the first one beading detail is absolutely gorgeous it has padding in the bust and it is just so so gorgeous i have all of them on my rack over there they are so heavy that i think my rack is going to fall down but this is absolutely gorgeous and the fabric is such high quality i cannot go wrong with that the hemming is really good as well and it has layering so for a dress that is not that expensive i think it is so highly made and the shipping didn't take that long i think Think it took about 10 days which for a wedding dress or something for an occasion is just amazing i used to wear these for my pageants when i did them if you're interested in me doing a pageant video please comment down below because i did pageants for about five years and i've got a lot to tell you about pageants but these are the sort of dresses i used to wear for my formal wear so this is the first one that i'm going to show you the second one that i'm going to show you is just this dress here it is so heavy it's got this band over here i mean i don't really have the occasion to wear these at the minute <laughs> and not that much in general but i just love love having them they are just such beautiful dresses so I'm gonna go and try that on for you now and see what you think so this is the next dress on now the first thing I'll say is it is incredibly hard to get on without assistance it's got these like clasps at the back so if you're doing this on your own it will take you quite a while I've not done it up fully just because it is really hard to do up all of these dresses are not custom made by the way so some of the sizes are a little bit off like this is a little bit big around the waist but it is still such a beautiful dress it is also slightly long i always found that when i wore this so i've not got any shoes on but when i wore this with heels it was still slightly long so you have to like pull it up but i do absolutely love the dress the beading is absolutely gorgeous like it's done so well it is such an incredible incredible dress so i'm going to come up close so you can see what i mean by the detailing here so it has got this beading belt here so it clasps around the back like I said I've not done it up fully and it's got a clasp on top by the neck so if I turn around you can see it's kind of like this circle at the back which looks absolutely beautiful I like the way it shows my tattoo as well so I feel like it is an absolutely gorgeous dress just slightly long on me and a bit big but if that doesn't matter to you it's got a beautiful train as well so if you were to hold that out, I don't know if you can see the train down the back, but it is so formal and just so beautiful. So if you have the occasion to wear it, I really would recommend it. So this is the second dress. Third dress that I'm going to show you, I've never worn before. So I got this in the post. I feel like this is going to be slightly better on me because it kind of goes up at the front, but I'm going to go and try that on for you now and see what you think. So this is the third dress on, and I am going to be honest that this fits a lot better than last one. I think it's because it does have the front up which means it's easier to walk and not trip over it's a lot less of a fancy dress i would say it's a lot lighter it's not got as much beading work or fabric so it is a cheaper dress in general but i would say that this is suit more suitable for less formal events like you could wear this to a dinner or something formal rather than the other one it would be a pageant a prom or something very very formal just because of the heaviness of it and the terrain it is very fancy i really like this i really like the satin detail and the layering the layering feels lovely and flowy it's not a hard net 
apart from the bottom which you can feel here it is a very very thin and twill like so it is great to swish as well it comes down at the back like you can see here it's just got one zip and it is a v-neck it has got a bit of padding in which is nice too to give it a bit of shape i'd say the top is slightly big but not excessively like it doesn't look ridiculous if i come up close here you can see what i mean by the beading so it's just got a little bit of beading on the belt but nothing too fancy. Now it is incredibly black. <laughs> like I say, I don't normally wear black, but I really do like this dress. So this is the third one. The next dress that I'm going to show you is actually a two piece. So it comes with this big skirt and this top. Now I think this is going to be slightly hard to get on, but I'm going to go and try it on for you and see what you think. So this is the next outfit on. Now it was incredibly hard to get on on myself, but it is absolutely gorgeous. I really like these two piece style things. I think they are absolutely stunning and a little bit different. This, I don't know, has pockets. I hope it does, but we will see. No, this doesn't have pockets. Sometimes the JGS House Official skirts do have pockets in them, which are amazing, but this one doesn't. However, it is still absolutely incredible. This skirt is just gorgeous and this top just makes it a little bit more kind of different. It's just very, very glitzy, but has that sophisticated nature because of the satin skirt if i come up close you can see what i mean by the detailing so it is just this fully sequined top with these bigger beads it does up at the top like this like i said i haven't done the whole thing and it fits slightly odd and then there i think it is slightly big on me the top but i feel like if i try and adjust it i can probably do that myself by like pulling the tags in just making it a bit more fitted i think that's probably why it's better to get the custom order they do take slightly longer the custom orders that's probably why i didn't want to go and do it but they do if you have the time do fit a lot better but i absolutely love this outfit so this is the next one so this is the next one on and it is exactly the same as the last one but i actually prefer the color so much more it is such a beautiful beautiful color and it surprisingly fits a lot better considering they are exactly the same size i don't really know why but the top really does fit a lot better so this skirt is absolutely gorgeous i'm going to come up close so you can see the beading so it fits really nicely on the waist it has just a zip up like before it is floor length and it is layered this has just got fully sequined again with the same sort of beading the top is secured like before so it is exactly the same as the last one just a different color but fits slightly better so i don't really know why but anyway i'm not complaining i do prefer this one to the last one just because the color is so gorgeous on my skin tone i think that's because i've got some fake tan on because it is winter actually it is snowed today so these are not appropriate clothing for the weather but i like wearing nice dresses anyway i'm going to go on to the next one so this is the next one i've actually done a shoot in this before it is incredibly heavy and it is such a princess dress but I absolutely love it so I'm gonna go and try it on now and see what you think so this is the next one on and isn't this gorgeous I love the long sleeve detail it does seem a little bit different than the normal dress most dresses are short sleeved or I've got little sleeves like this but I love some long sleeves I find it a bit more secured and just a little bit more I don't know feminine and princessy this dress is absolutely gorgeous now I don't really know where I'm ever going to wear this but it is absolutely gorgeous it has got so much layering so much fabric has gone into this and it has got these like foam pads here which make it look like it's kind of not padded but it is into the dress and it is done so well it looks like you are just got skin underneath but obviously you're fully covered but that is because it is cleverly done with the foam in skin color so i think that is absolutely amazing i'm going to come up close to you here so you can see what i mean by the detailing so it's just got this embroidered pattern here with a few sequins i like the simple detail of it it comes down at the back like a v-shape and it is just beautifully fitted there's some buttons on the side here so this is the next one on it i think this is one of the more expensive ones but i'm not too sure i will leave all the links down below for you so you can check out the dresses if you like them so the next dress that i'm going to show you is just this satin number here this one has got pockets so i'm excited to try this on so i'm gonna go and try this on and see what you think so this is the next one on and the only thing i'm going to say is it really needs ironing now i didn't realize how much satin creases but i'm really scared to iron it because i don't know whether the fabric is going to iron well 
but I will see what my mum says and maybe do it inside out. However, I absolutely adore this. I love the pockets. I'm one for a pocket. I think if you've watched my previous videos, you know I love anything with a pair of pockets. So this is like this. It has a slit up the knee, so it is absolutely gorgeous. The back detail has these kind of crossover straps, which I think is a beautiful kind of addition to it. Like said here, it kind of crosses over and adds a little bit of a different feature to it without needing to add sequining or jewels or anything like that. Like that it has such a sophisticated and simple look but is so so well done when i come up close you can see what i mean by the fabric and the detailing so it's got a little bit of padding in here and it has this crossover detail now i feel like it's absolutely gorgeous the color is really sophisticated like i said these dresses i will not wear it on a regular occasion but for anything like formal or anything like that is absolutely gorgeous this fits very well as well unfortunately guys the last bit of that video did not record so i am back filming the ending so i hope you've enjoyed watching this jjs house haul i absolutely adore all the dresses honestly they have some great great picks they also have dresses and like items for everyday wear which is amazing too they have some really lovely jumpers and things like that so i'm going to leave all the links down below and the website you should really really check them out i've left a discount code too i really hope you've enjoyed watching and i hope to see you in my next one please make sure to subscribe and turn the notification bell on i upload videos weekly so thank you again guys and i will speak to you soon bye bye